the new EMP Stealth card, a Mythic Cardboard Box, and the new best AR in the entire game. All of this and more while I, an Unreal Ranked player, face off against 99 Silver Ranked players. I hope you enjoy! Now something you guys may not have known is that they really buffed the Enforcer AR, so now it does 56 headshot and 34 body shot. And it fires a little bit faster too. So it's actually a pretty decent AR now, especially if you hit those headshots. Now I'm gonna go Lavish Lair just because there's a ton of floor loot spawns there, and you can get them with the Mythic Cardboard Box um, anywhere on floor spawns. And you can also get them from rare chests, but I think it's just easier to fly over the POI and look to see if we see anything old. Because I really want to get one like right off spawn, because if I have to go around searching the whole game, then that's going to be super boring for you guys. And I want to keep you guys entertained. That way you're willing to subscribe, because it's my goal to get to 250,000 subs before the end of the year. And I think we can do that if just all of you guys subscribe right now. All right, give me a Mythic Cargo Box, please. That's not a Mythic. Another thing you guys may not have known is they changed the roofs here, so now you can like just run straight up. It makes it so much easier to get around. This guy is having a bad day. Oh man, those hip fires are really hitting. Poor dude. Ooh. I found the new EMP Stealth Camo and Anvil Rocket Launcher. This one's actually more rare than the cardboard. See, the, even the guards don't notice me. Well, they kind of do. I also think they changed the Thunderburst SMG too. It feels like it's not as... It's not quite as good as it was. I'm gonna use the new Stealth Camo while I'm over here, just in case there's someone else just camping the vault. And there is, apparently. There we go. That's a pretty good use for that. He didn't even know I was there. And it damaged him when I came out of it. This guy right here, let me just use the camo and see if it takes away his shield when I come out of it. Alright, let's take it off. Um, I think it does. I'm not completely sure. It looked like it did. And there's another guy here. What are these silver players doing? It looks like they removed sniper spawns from here because there were just two ARs. So I don't know if they're just trying to nerf the sniper by making it more rare or what. And there was a guy right there. Let me out. I'm stuck. There's one more guy. Cracked. Oh my gosh. That thing is pretty good. 110 on him. Oh my gosh, that thing shreds. I'm actually kind of starting to like the new AR. Goodness gracious, that thing is good. It actually feels like the AR was meant to be good, not just some random one they threw in because they needed to add more. Alright, I'm going to show you guys the best weapon attachments for your Enforcer AR. So you're going to want the Red Eye Sight, the Drum Mag, the Angled Foregrip, as well as the Muzzle Brake. And I'll just make it so it really lasers people, because there's no recoil whatsoever. You know, we haven't really had anything with rockets in the game in a little while. Well, I mean, last season, Season OG, we had the Rocket Launcher, but we haven't had anything like the Anvil Rocket Launcher in a long time and I've forgotten if it was good or not so I think I'll carry that instead of a sniper this game or at least until I can find the mythic cardboard box now there's some new symbols on the map like this and I guess that shows the guards now there's also a fight over here so let's go check it out we use the new AR and oh my gosh this thing destroys oh and this guy he had the Mythic Cardboard Box. I'm gonna test it out in half a second. I just wanna see what this looks like if I fire it. Just that something. Okay, so if I lock on here, it goes up and then down to it. That's actually pretty cool. Ooh, there's a grapple blade. I'm gonna definitely take that. It's much better than the shockwaves. Even though the shockwaves are good for gaining away immediately, the grapple blade is just better overall because you can always have mobility. There's a medallion guy close to here. Two of them actually. 
near fencing fields. Ah, there's one of the guys. Oh, there's another one on me, apparently. I don't know where. There's the guy. I'm gonna get the third party. Not, wait, did I just knew 92 or is that 32? Now I got two people sniping at me. I think I'm just gonna drive out of here. Cause I really don't want to deal with being pinched between three people. I'm gonna use this right now. And we'll run over this way. We'll use it to get over to this bush. I'm gonna creep this way. Oh, he's running uh, over that way already, okay. The cardboards can be pretty good, especially like if you have a sniper. I should probably carry one. I need to find some ones with good attachments. So anyone on the island? Doesn't appear like there is. Let me just throw down a cardboard box for me. And now I can survey the area without worrying about being headshot sniped. Now the real question is, can I pad with the cardboard box? Uh, it removes it, unfortunately. There's a guy right here. I'm gonna go straight into the bush. And then put on a cardboard box. Oh wow. When you're crouched, you peek out, and when you peek back in, that's pretty cool. You can peek out, shoot, go back in, and be safe from headshot snipe, which I find to be very useful, especially now with the sniper meta. Ooh, you can reload guns in the box. That's interesting. Man, these guys need to chill. He sniped off my box. That's rude. Uh-oh. I just fell. I have height, though. You can also use the cardboard boxes as, like, a barriers to hide behind. I have zone, so I just gotta stay up here and knock a headshot snipe. Which all these guys apparently want to do. Man, long range... The ARs are not very good. This guy over here, if only I had a sniper. Oh, there are those guys fighting. Hit him 32, cracked him. Oh, he's one shot. There we go, I got the kill. Last guy. I see him over there, he's trying to camouflage. But it's not working very well for him. Right here, I think I'll make a, like, a little barrier of boxes. To hide behind, I see him right there. He's gonna try to get to that rock right there. But I'm not gonna let him. I'll stay right here and let him just get pushed out by zone. Man, he's low. There we go. Man, the cardboard boxes were pretty useful and so was the, the invisible device. If you want to see more content like this, then make sure to like and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.